In this video, I'm going to show you how to cross-list your courses. So the reason you might want to cross-list your courses is if you have taught three of the same course, you will want to combine them. Or because of the hybrid scheduling, you may have uh, one section that's split into two, um, so you'll want to combine those so that you only have one to manage. So from this, I've created three courses. You see it listed across the top. Crossless Parent Course, Crossless Child 1, and Crossless Child 2. These are just example names that I've created. You can pick any of your three or four or five different sections of the same topic to combine together. So I'm going to get my go to my parent course and I'm going to select that, that six digit course code at the end. And I'm going to copy it. So I'm copying 153816. Now I'm gonna to go to my child course, and I'm gonna to go to settings. I'm gonna to go to my sections, and I'm gonna click on this course section. I'm gonna say cross list this section, and this is where I'm gonna enter that course code that I want it to cross to. Then I will cross list it. All right, and now it is cross listed, it says successful. I'm gonna do the same thing in child two. So again, I go down, Go to settings, click on sections, click on the section for this course. There's only going to be one. I'm going to say cross list this section, and I'm going to enter that course code again for that parent course. All right, so now I've connected them. It says successful. I'm going to go back to my parent course, down to settings. You'll now see them all listed here under sections. So I've added those other two children. That means when I go to an assignment, if I wanted to make a new assignment, you'll see that by default it's assigned to everyone. But if I just wanted it to be assigned to one of those sections, I would just select the one that I wanted it assigned to. And then only those students would see the assignment in the classroom. So that's how you'll cross this your classes. If you have any questions, please let us know.